Hallo Leute und willkommen zu meinem YouTube-Channel. Guten Morgen oder guten Tag. Ich heiße Michael und ich komme aus Amerika. Heute lese ich Ohne Dich von Rammstein. Now, Rammstein ist eine Rockband und sehr, sehr heavy metal. Um, this is a band I listen to too often when it comes to German music, but Ohne Dich is a very simple or sehr einfach Lied und ich denke, dass ich verstehe alles und I think that it's one of those songs that doesn't have too much speed so again, when they're singing their song it's a lot easier to actually understand them compared to some of their other songs um, again, this doesn't seem as it's so heavy metal or so heavy rock so again, it seems more like a classic rock type song Now, Rammstein has been around for a very long time. Um, if you haven't heard of them, you've probably been living under a rock for the most part. But again, they are a well-known German rock band and they've traveled all over the world. I know a lot of my friends from America are huge Rammstein fans. Even though they have no idea what they're actually saying, they just love the way that they play their music. So again, today we are going to jump into Ona Dick. Now, Today's German word, again, I try to use German words that are in the song, is ohne. So, O-H-N-E. Ohne means without. So, ohne dick, without you, is what the name of this song actually means. Now, without further ado, let's get into the song. Los Gates. So, the beginning of the song, Ich werde in die Tannen gehen, dahin, wo ich sie zuletzt gesehen, doch der Abend wird ein Tuch aufs Land und auf die Wege hinterm Wandern ran, und der Wald es steht so schwarz und leer, weh mir, oh weh, und die Vögel singen nicht mehr. Like I said, it's a little bit of an easier German song compared to a lot of their other German songs. Again, as I'm listening to this and reading it, I definitely understand it a little bit better. But what that first part is saying, I will go into the furs. So like Christmas trees furs is what they're talking about. Where I was last, where I last saw her, but the evening throws a cloth over the country and on the path behind the edge of the forest. And the forest is so black and empty. Pain me, oh pain, and the birds sing no more. So it seems like he's lost a love life or loved one, which seems to be a very common thing when it comes to German songs. And he just has so much pain, which that's that Weimir, and the birds are just singing no more for him either. So again, it's kind of a sadder, and traurig lead for um, us, but again, it's one of those songs, again, I think anyone that's hopping into German can definitely listen to the song and actually understand a lot of the words that are being said. And then, Moving on to the chorus, which again, I think is very easy. It's ohne dich kann ich ich sein, ohne dich. Mit dir bin ich auch allein, ohne dich. Ohne dich sah ich die Stunde, ohne dich. So again, ohne dich is the name of the song, which is why I use that word. But again, it means without you. So I cannot be without you, without you. With you, I am alone. Without you, without you, I count the hours, and without you. So, again, someone who's lost a loved one is now more alone in this world and very sad and doesn't really know what to do for the most part. Now, going to the next part. Mit stehen die Sekunden, lohne nicht auf den Asten in die Graben, ist es nun still und ohne Leben, Und das Atman fällt mir auch so schwer. Weh, me, oh weh. Und die Vogel singen nicht mehr. So, the seconds are with you, not worth it. On the branches, in the trenches. It is quiet now and without life. And breathing, so that's that Atma. So if you haven't heard the other Geboren song I've done, um, I talked about Atma and how it's a very useful German verb, but also it has 
things you can add on to like Einatma and Ausatman, which again makes inhale, exhale. So again, I'm slowly picking up more and more German words as I'm reading and seeing more German songs, which is super cool. Um, but yeah, so pain me, oh pain, and the birds sing no more. And then it goes back into the chorus with ohne dich kann ich nicht sein, ohne dich mit dir bin ich auch allein, ohne dich, ohne dich sehr ich die Stunde, ohne dich, mir dir stehen die Sekunde loren. So the only part that changes is that lonen at the end, which means worse. So I cannot be without you, without you, with you I am alone, without you, without you I count the hours, without you the seconds are with you worth. And it's like worthless, I think is what they're going for at the end, but he doesn't actually finish the word. It's just the way he says it. Now, like I said, this is a super easy German song. So again, if you're just starting to learn German, I recommend listening to this song a few times. Again, it's more of a slower song. They don't speed through like some of those other German singers like Crow, um, Deichkin, or Die Fante Fear. But again, it's one of those songs that the more and more you listen to it, you can definitely pick up those words. And the one thing I've noticed through German songs is that each song kind of uses a lot of the same words and also has that same um, tema which is that pretty much it's about a loved one and they're pretty much coming together as one or something's happened and now they're not together, which I think is the premise of most songs anyways. But again, it's one of those things that once you start learning that atmosphere or what's actually being said in each song, the words make a lot more sense. Now, watching the music video sometimes can also help as well because as you're watching those videos, you can kind of visualize exactly what they're saying not saying every German song is like that, but again, that is another way to help learn German. So that's all I have for today. Again, it is a shorter song, but again, I thought Ona Dick was a very good song. So again, if you do like this song, listen to it. If you're new to German, listen to it. And also, if you're new to this channel, make sure to like and subscribe. Um, we are still in our infancy stages, so I am trying to grow this channel each and every video. So liking the channel, hitting um, subscribe helps grow this channel. But also, if you write down any comments for me about which songs I should do, things that I can improve in, um, if I should probably speak more German, which I probably should since I'm trying to learn German. But again, I'm also trying to do this video as a way for German speakers to learn English as well, but also help my German. So again, it's kind of going both ways for people watching this video. So again, as always, we'll see you next time. Bis später. Tschüss.